This video presentation illustrates programming the Evenheat Ramp Master 2 using the ramp mode for ceramic firing. The ramp mode is a programming method that allows the ceramic artist to determine all the firing details. For guidance on firing data, refer to the Ramp Master 2 control manual, your ceramic ware supplier, or ceramic ware manufacturer. For this illustration, we'll program the Ramp Master 2 ramp mode for a cone 04 firing. Before powering up the kiln, place your ceramic ware into the kiln chamber and close the door or lid. Throw the kiln's power switch to the on position. The Ramp Master 2 will begin to initialize and then display idle. Idle simply means the Ramp Master 2 is at rest and is not running any program. To begin the ramp mode programming process, press the Enter Program key. The display will read User. This stands for User Program and the Ramp Master 2 is asking which of the eight available program slots you'd like to store your program. For this example, let's choose to store our program in program number 5. Type in 5. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The Ramp Master 2 is now asking for the number of segments you would like to use for this program. A segment is a combination of rate of temperature change, the desired temperature, and any hold or soak at the desired temperature. For this example, we want to use two segments. Type in 2. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The display now reads RA1. The Ramp Master 2 is asking for the temperature rate, or speed, to be used in segment 1. Rate is programmed in degrees per hour. For our example, let's use 500 degrees per hour. 500 degrees per hour is very typical for cone 04 ceramic wear. Type in 500. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The display now reads degrees Fahrenheit 1. The Ramp Master 2 is asking for the desired temperature to be reached in segment 1. For our example, we want to go up to a temperature 108 degrees Fahrenheit shy of our final temperature. The cone 04 equivalent temperature is 1945. So, 1945 minus 108 equals 1837 degrees. Type in 1837. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The display now reads HLD1. The Ramp Master 2 is asking for the desired hold time at our segment 1 temperature. For this example, we're not going to hold at our 1837 degrees. Hold time is programmed in hours and minutes. Values to the right of the decimal point are in minutes, and values to the left of the decimal point are in hours. We don't want any hold time, so we'll type in zero. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The display now reads RA2. Since we have programmed in all firing data for segment 1, the Ramp Master is now asking for our temperature rate to be used in segment 2, which will be our final firing temperature. While many cone charts exist showing equivalent temperatures, based on final rate, we're using the familiar 108 degree Fahrenheit per hour chart. 108 degrees Fahrenheit per hour being the rate of temperature increase at the end of the firing. So our example will use 108 degrees per hour to get to our cone 04 temperature. Type in 108. Press the Enter key to store your choice. The display now reads degrees Fahrenheit 2. The Ramp Master is asking for a desired temperature for segment 2. 108 cone charts indicate that 1945 degrees Fahrenheit is our equivalent cone temperature, so that's what we'll use. Type in 1945.
press the enter key to store your choice. The display now reads HLD2. The Ramp Master is asking for the desired hold time at our segment 2 temperature. This is the hold time at our final temperature. Generally speaking, ceramic firing is normally complete once the cone has been reached. However, certain ceramic firings may benefit from a hold or soak at final temperature. For our example, we will choose not to add any hold at the final temperature. We'll type in zero. Press the enter key to store your choice. The display now reads ALRM, which stands for alarm. You may set the alarm to sound at any temperature you'd like. For this example, we will disable the alarm by typing in 9999. Press the enter key to store your choice. CPL is briefly displayed, followed by idle. The Ramp Master 2 Ramp Mode programming is now complete and ready to fire your Ramp Mode program. To begin the Ramp Mode firing, press the Start Stop key one time and then press the Enter key. This video presentation is now complete. Even Heat provides a number of video presentations for our products. We invite you to visit evenheat-kiln.com for a complete listing. Thank you.